Well, Square Enix, you're third leak within a year. That sucks, bruh. Also, there are no spoilers in this video. I think leaks are ridiculous, and I will not spoil myself nor the viewers. Hey guys, what is going on? Narciss here from RLP Gaming Projects. Now, I am definitely late on getting this news out, but life is crazy sometimes, and it cannot be helped. So let's get into the shit ton of Final Fantasy VII Remake news. So, a Final Fantasy VII demo was pretty well confirmed to be coming out on the PlayStation Store, according to GameStat, who captured a snapshot or something like that, I don't know, they, they seen something on the PlayStation Store about a Final Fantasy VII de demo. This is really exciting that we may see a Final Fantasy VII Remake demo before the game actually releases. I personally don't think we'll see the demo until the game releases, but I could very easily be wrong, and I really, really hope, guys, that I am. Now, next what happens does confirm the existence of the Final Fantasy VII Remake demo. It was leaked. People who have jailbroken PlayStation 4s are able to obtain this demo, and all of the information of what is in the demo has been leaked out. The leakers went even further as to hack into the demo and pull out a lot of information pertaining to the full Final Fantasy VII Remake game. From what I know since I'm trying to avoid spoilers the best that I can, is that the whole script for the first game in the remake and part of the second game script has been leaked along with certain character reveals. I'm just gonna say this, that leaks to this degree are ridiculous. People are so desperate for views that they post ridiculous leaks like this ruining the games for others. And the developer of these games put a lot of work into them, and the leakers compromised the quality of the game's impact on the community with their leaks. When Kingdom Hearts 3 was leaked back in December of 2018, I was watching a video from a leak-free content creator, and I decided to look in the comment section. Right there in the comments, someone said that they watched the spoiler and was disappointed that they did and that he or she or whoever done it was going to ruin it for us since it was ruined for them and revealed Zigbar as being Lushu. I was pissed. This person is ridiculous and we need to stand against leaks like this. Now, a release date being leaked or a trailer being revealed early, that's one thing. But to reveal information that gives out crucial spoilers to the game is crazy and I wish they would stop. If they don't, I see Western releases being delayed till months after their initial release in Japan to prevent spoilers. A small few will ruin it for the rest of us. <laughs> now that I'm done with that rant, I will move on to the final bit of Final Fantasy VII Remake news, and that is the remake has now been delayed to April 10th, 2020. This is definitely a kick between the legs to us big Final Fantasy VII fans, but as long as it helps make the game be the best that it can be, then so be it. One month is not too much longer, so hopefully we can all survive. But guys, I just wanted to give you a quick update in case you've missed anything. Watch out for spoilers because they are abundant and everywhere, and that is going to conclude this video. I am finally back in the full swing of things, so be prepared for more uploads. Please make sure to comment, like, subscribe, and until the next project, guys, take it easy. I'm out.